I was so disappointed to learn that you were carrying Nicholas's child. No, I had so hoped that he would produce an heir with someone more suitable. How do you even know? Oh, I always know. But why does my grandson have a penchant for fragile, mamby-pamby women? Well, something edible, I suppose. Get out of my room. You know, you're not as mealy and pure as you appear. No, you have... You have a black heart and a cruel streak like a true Cassidine. Oh, but you're a liar. No, you would lie down for any man. And you don't have the common sense to know that passion is a weapon. And sex, best used as a negotiator. You don't tool. know me. Well enough. But what is good is that you've accomplished something that I never could. A permanent rift between Lucky and Nicholas. Brava. I think that we could be friends. I despise you. <laughs> it doesn't matter. As long as you pass along that dark, cruel street to your child. You will never get near my child. And who do you suppose would stop me? You won't get away with this. Oh, you shouldn't make threats like that. Well, something terrible could happen to you or your baby. You stay away from my baby, you bitch. No, no get out. Elizabeth, they say, get out. Elizabeth, you should not get yourself worked up. I'm going to tell Nicholas what you threatened, and I'll tell Lucky, and he'll arrest you if he doesn't kill you first. Oh, you poor child. Now, you're more disturbed than we knew. Thank heavens you had the good sense to, to institutionalize Just yourself. Get out! Elizabeth. You, Take it easy no, and wait, settle down. You keep her away from me. Don't get out. No, she's delusional. Let, let go of me. You're aware she's pregnant. Of course. You keep her away from my baby. Oh, Elizabeth, now, of course, we will protect your child. Nothing happens to that child, is that clear? I understand perfectly, Mrs. Cassidy. She needs to be medicated. Is Dr. Handel in? Yes, ma'am. Good. It's time he earns that obscene and dull this facility. Oh, Elizabeth. Now, I will see to it that you are well taken care of. Now, you're in my hands now. You can't have my baby! You have to calm down. My child. It's probably just as well. She's so pale. I thought you'd bring Cam by to see his mother. I don't want him to see her like this. It's bad enough that all the other kids call his mom crazy slut, 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 slut. What about Jake? You bring him by? He's too young and terrified when he sees his bit this way. Jake is uh, happy with me and Sam. I don't want to risk upsetting that. You may just tell Cam that his mom is sick. The doctors, doctors are working to make her better. Tell Stefan when he's old enough. And that his mother's just uh, too sick for him to see her. You keep him, Jake, safe? Never goes anywhere without a guard. Elizabeth was wrong about that. Jake's fine with me. could have come out of this condition of yours, but you didn't, and you never will, 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 will. Maybe it's just as well. This way I can pity you instead of hating you.
to do this when I was a kid. Told myself that no one could see me down here. I see you. I feel you. Please tell me you're real. Well, I'm not the first person to accuse me of being too good to be true. Why do you think that is? Maybe it's those dimples. There she is. each other so open with respect <laughs> yeah well we have our moments right now she's all over me for not taking down the outdoor christmas decorations yet it is almost spring i know i know she says the same thing clearly i'm outnumbered <laughs> patrick how would you feel if robin cheated on you with your brother i don't know to say what hurt would be an understatement but you know, I'd like to believe that I'd try and be fair. I would have to know why, you know, what my part in it was. We're human. We're imperfect. Is it possible to be imperfect and still be a good mother? You know, when you're on a plane and you're traveling with children and they say when the oxygen masks come down to put yours on first and then you put your kids on, well, that's what you're doing right now. You're taking care of yourself makes you a good mother, don't you think? I have to be okay for them. Well, don't forget me. I mean, I gotta get by without my best scrub nurse. <laughs> Hopefully it won't be too long. It won't be long. As long as you concentrate on yourself, it's the most important thing right now. Thank you. Absolutely. Anything you need. shame? Why, this is a new low, even for you. I mean, cuckolding Lucky with Nicholas and then getting pregnant. That should have been enough for you. But now you're throwing yourself at another woman's husband? Patrick's just a friend. A friend? Or a, a brother-in-law? It always starts out so innocently with you, Elizabeth. But what disturbs me about this whole sordid love affair with Nicholas is that he blames himself and you are clearly the sexual predator. No, even your sainted lucky isn't enough for you. You want more what? Attention? Oh, you have everyone's attention now. You are the town tramp. I can still have you run out of here. Ah, see, go. there is that fire. At least have the decency to own up to it for the sake of your children. Three little urchins by three different men, and you not married to a single one, you're ripe for will. Wait up! Get the hell away from her, or I will blow your head off. 